What's up, y'all? What's happening? It's Mulatto, Big Lotto, and this is who I am. I'm from Atlanta. Specifically, I'm from the south side of Atlanta. I'm from Clay County. We call it Clayco, Jurassic Park. You know what I'm saying? Um, it's country. You know what I'm saying? We live in our own little world. We definitely got a little country slang, country twang to us. Um, but it's cool. Atlanta is um, Atlanta is the, the mecca for like black entrepreneurship. You know what I'm saying? So I feel like I had like a, a different um, culture instilled within me growing up. Well, I started rapping when I was 10 years old. So like I started rapping real young. Before that, I drag race though. Like all the men in my family drag race, so we go to the drag races, like the drag strips in Atlanta. It'd be like the biggest dope boys in the city, like rappers, like everybody be out there. It'd be like car shows, races, people grilling out. Like it'd be, it'd be like a whole ghetto ass party. It's lit. So I was, I was out there with my daddy, so I started rapping. The first one would probably be. Nikita and um, Nikita Dragon on Instagram and um, Bretman Rock on Instagram, they had did like this treadmill challenge type of thing. And you know, like with this new generation, like that social media challenges shit, that should be taking them songs off. So when they did that challenge, it like introduced me to, they got millions of followers. So that like introduced me to a whole nother fan base. Um, Demi Lovato was um, posting my song, listening to my song on her story, and she even tagged me and shit in it. So that that went the fuck up. Um, Rihanna was on live, dancing to the song with her best friend. Uh, so that took the fuck off. Um, it had it had hella moments, like it had hella moments. Oh, the coolest thing I ever bought with rap money um, this Christmas. I blew the bag. Um, I bought my dad a bust down Rolex for his um, for Christmas, and I had got my mom a kitchen remodel. So they they both was like they was like my daddy cried, my mama cried, I cried, <laughs> Gates cried too. Look, <laughs> now nah, that was lit. Like this really is a dream for me. Like like I said, I started rapping when I was ten years old. So. I'm really living out all that stuff that that 10 year old me prayed and just dreamed of, you know what I'm saying? So I be just taking it all in. Like, I'm grateful for everything. Like, when people send me shit to the P.O. box, I be like, they sending me shit? Like, I be grateful for everything because it's literally what I wanted to do. It's not, it wasn't no trend for me. It's not no label telling me to do this or like, you know what I'm saying? It's not for us, nothing like this, really my dream. The biggest misconception people have about me is that I'm cocky and I'm like drama and shit. Cause the rap game, you know what I'm saying? Like that that TV shit, it, it'll have you, you know what I'm saying? And then being so young, like just being so gullible and just um, being fed lines and stuff, like just saying whatever, like letting people portray me a certain way, you know what I'm saying? Big Lotto, that's who I am.